program menu and gotten to the new program list, you want to type in CIRC and then press enter. So today, for today's little experiment, um, to kind of teach you how to program, like to the beginning of programming, of today's test, be trying to find um, the area of a circle by just typing in the radius. Press clear and then go to program and then go to edit and then type in your then go down scroll down and find CIRC and then press enter okay so um, if you want to find so first you need the radius to be able to find the area of the circle so you need to be able to have a place to input the radius so the computer can calculate oh here is um, uh, here's the radius now I just need to do these things to find the area yeah, so go to second catalog, like when you're in the edit menu. Um, it should be the zero key. Um, catalog should be in yellow over it, so that's why you're doing second. Um, then click on X squared, because you want it to go into the I part, because you want to find the, punc the function called input. So once you get to the input function, it should be right above the in string function. Um, click on the input function, and then you need to input then you need to put a variable, so you put input and then r is for the radius. So after you have that, um, you need to figure out the equation. For area, it is radius squared times pi. So then what you do is you go, then you click enter. After you've done input r, click enter, and then do, um, type in alpha, and then the multiply key, because that's alpha r, you get R again. Um, alpha R and then find squared times and then wherever pi is, I think. Right now you're just basically writing R squared times pi because you have in, you've inputted R. So now you just need to multiply by pi. So after you've done that, you just need to store it to another variable. So like you have the variable that you input it in, which is R, and I need to store it to your answer. So like after it's calculated, it has to have some place to store it so that when you want to bring it up or view it or change it, it has that. So then just um, click the store key, which is STO. It's right above the on key. Then let's see. Yeah, store it, and then we'll just store it to variable. We'll just store it to V because, I don't know, V is a cool letter. Um, so then what you do is, this is a very simple program, um, you just go to, if you want to see something, like if you want to like display, um, go to catalog uh, D, or, and then go down to DISP, and then uh, click wherever V is. And that should work. So then click enter again, click quit, and then click CIRC or program in the execute menu because you know how there's the edit and the new it's on the far left then click enter again and then there should be a question mark when you click enter um, enter your radius which I'll just say my radius is 2 and then your area is now 12.566 um, if you have any questions about how I did this uh, just leave a comment at the bottom and yeah I'll have more episodes about this later